Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your award-winning Mark Lamar Panther Band in the Blue Band. <laughs> Introducing Blue Band officers, Captain Haley Stringer. Captain Haley Stringer. Blue Diamond of the Week is Reagan Johnson. Congratulations to Panther Band of the Week. Mackenzie Beckman, Colin Jones, Jensen Welch, Corey Johnson, Ricky Perez, Sydney Wilson, and Amy Carpenter. Sixth of the week, the Blue Diamonds. The band can swear to thank the sponsor of Band of the Week. The Panther Band will perform its 2014 contest show, Art at the Speed of Life, which earned superior ratings at marching contests. The show features a beautiful array of exhilarating music depicting the variety in life and its relationship to art. The show features solos by Adrian Andrews, Madison Sachs, Mackenzie Beckman, and narration by Seth Sterling. Drum Major. Savannah Bishop, Seth Gurley, and Grant Erickson. Is the band ready? And now, here they are, the North Lamar Panther Band. Gentlemen, I would like to present to you Exhibit A, Art is Everywhere. Now, my hypothesis, art is the handwriting of the human consciousness and the very spirit of life itself. But is art the force behind creating rhythms, designs, and harmonies? Could art, composition, and creativity all drive towards the search for things like knowledge, understanding, and most importantly, exploration. Audience, we invite you to sit back, relax, and allow us to guide you on our exploration.
numbers, patterns, art. Everywhere. So, restate my assumption, there is art everywhere. So consider the stock market. Now, Escher believed that art could be understood through numbers and patterns. Well, the stock market is a universe of numbers. Millions of human hands at work, billions of minds. It's a vast network screaming with life. So consider, if Escher's theory is true that there is art in numbers, then perhaps within the stock market there is a whole sense of hidden patterns right in front of us! Press return! Results? No results. No results! Only numbers! Shakespeare to write, and it was nature that brought Debussy to compose, therefore nature must be a gift from the heavens to the soul of an artist.
Thank you very much for your time.